What makes the Amanita so magical? The primary active component is mucimol. It's water soluble and it's not a classic psychedelic. It binds to GABA-A receptors instead of the 5-HT2A. It also creates very different effects. They tend to be euphoric and disassociative. So at this point, you may be thinking, wait, I heard the Amanita mushroom was toxic. Yes, there are toxins in it, but they break down when you dry them. That's why they've been demonized by the church during the Christianization of Europe. A lot like what the government did with psychedelics after the 60s. People thought they were toxic, but in fact, they just needed special preparation. So remember that, it's very important to dry the mushrooms. Do not eat raw Amanita, it's toxic. And the toxins decay when the mushroom is dried. 